You know, it seems almost constantly that I hear from people that their lives are almost out of control, that they're getting busier, that there is increased activity all the time and increased responsibilities. For many, it is the busiest time of their lives. To ensure the success of all of our tasks and our projects, let us increase our quiet times in proportion to our active times. Quiet times recharge us. Quiet times fill us with energy and also it causes time to expand. And it is something that is so very valuable you'll begin to rely on it more and more. Now, at first, it seems counterproductive to take time for relaxation. But such times will, you'll find, rejuvenate you and energize you. It says in Isaiah 30, verse 15, In returning and rest you shall be saved. Returning to what? Returning to your natural state. And when you rest, you're going to be saved from the constant busyness that sometimes gets you in trouble. It gets you in trouble through anxiety and, and over-tiredness that causes you to make mistakes. Now I continue. In quietness and in trust. Trust in what? Trust in God shall be your strength. To spend a few minutes in conscious relaxation enables you to tune out any outer confusion. It allows you again to focus on the reason for the wonderful life that you're living itself and you're preparing your mind and your heart for a wonderful rebirth of consciousness of God being with you of God being your help in every need of God helping you and working through you in every project you're able to remain perfectly poised perfectly relaxed and at peace. Remembering to take the time for relaxation and rest will help you to have the most memorable time of your life. Looking back on your weeks, you'll realize that that was the time that everything started to change for the better.